So what's your sacred space? Let's talk about that. Here, I want to welcome you to another episode of Prosperity TV live and in color with all the jackhammers and construction going on uh, in my uh, place here in Southern California. But I wanted to, to just share a quick show with you this week and talk about a sacred space. And by that, I mean a place that you go where you can be alone with your thoughts, a place you can meditate, a place you can brainstorm a place where you can find harmony and peace. Now why I picked doing it here, and I'm sorry about all the jackhammers, they're building a new uh, uh, energy company, is building an a office over there. Uh, but this is my balcony here, and I picked it because of course I have a lovely view, and I'll clip in some footage here as you can see. I'm actually overlooking the baseball stadium, so that's why I bought this place. Uh, but as soon as I saw this balcony, I knew I was going to make this my little zen oasis in the middle of this downtown urban area. Uh, so I created this uh, vertical garden and uh, you know it's just and I've got other plants, a little love seed. I put a, a space heater up in case it gets chilly at night and I just come out here in the evenings with a, a cup of uh, green tea and it's like a spiritual experience for me. Uh, in the mornings when I wake up, I'll come out and do my, my reading, my daily word, or my meditation. I get to sit out here on the balcony with these, you know, the green around me. Uh, and I think that's an important part of prosperity. We're all busy. You've got the kids and the dry cleaning and the job and the bills to pay and the things to do. But you've got to have a place, a space and a place that you can go where you can just center. And it doesn't have to be a balcony, it doesn't have to be a carpet, it can be anywhere. It could be, you could remodel a broom closet, you could take a walk-in closet. Maybe it's just some place out in the yard, maybe it's a park nearby. Um, but it's important you have a place to be able to center yourself and get back to your core uh, being, your beingness of being you. So let me know, do you have a place? Get down below and uh, share with us where you hang out. What's your secret, sacred place? And of course, as usual, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Tell your friends about the channel. And of course, like and share. And until next week, peace. Love you guys. And live rich. Only I could think about doing a video about a sacred space to meditate and have a guy with a jackhammer start up immediately. <laughs>